Wisconsin, we knew they were gonna push the pace today, but they gotta make sure they do it in a controlled, efficient way. Caroline Strandy with the ball. She'll give it to Wiggins on the outside. That's Rachel Kent in the far corner. Nothing but net for her to get things started. It's just staying on the court. A really great player for this team if she can keep herself out of foul trouble as Strandy tries to go up for a shot, but it's taken down by Jimenez. Now Jimenez takes it all the way across. She'll dish it off nice. to Sarah Williams for her first basket of the night. Five seconds left on the shot clock. We'll go back to Williams in the lane. They kick it out to the corner to Jimenez. Jimenez is going to kick it up for the last second and able to get it in for Wisconsin. And what a veteran play from Jimenez. Bounces just outside. Wisconsin now going to try and hurry things up a little bit. They'll go to the left wing for Sanaya Copeland. Nails by her. Wisconsin able to snag it as Jimenez is going to go coast to coast, but she'll kick it outside. And Sarah Williams with the three-pointer. Can she get it? Buckets. 500 points for Sarah Williams. Norman going to go with the response, but it's smacked down by Sarah Williams. Now transition on the other side of the court. Natalie Leitzinger will give it back to Williams. Two on one, no issue for her. Butler trying to find a response here. They're going to kick it out to Strandy. Strandy nowhere to go. They'll go to the outside of Melman's, and she's got the response. That's got to feel so great for her. And such a valuable contributor on this team. Great story by her. She gets the layup, and it's, she's been waiting. Not a super polished scorer right now, but just a sophomore. I expect her to be a key piece of future Melman's Badger offense. Melman's from the wing finally breaks the streak for Butler as well. Leading the Big Ten in steals per game and total steals so far. As she's going to take a near side corner three, nails it. And that's got to feel good for her, shooting 25% from deep going into this game. She tries a lot of attempts, and in my opinion, that's proof that she can hit those shots. Coach Mo wouldn't be letting her take that many if she wasn't confident she can make them. Mismatch on the inside. Rachel Kent's going to take it up for the basket and one. You can tell she's feeling it, has been able to shoot at all three levels today so far. As she defends Jane just near the high point, Rachel Kent's going to take a three-pointer from the top of the three and connects. Norman now on the wing. She'll kick it out to Kent for another three-point attempt, and she's feeling it. And six offensive rebounds in this game, five points to show for it. As the impound bass goes nowhere, Rachel Kent going to take advantage of that, and she'll go in for the score. 17 points posting up against her, on, especially on those inside plays, trying to prevent any good shots from her being taken. As Strandy on the other end nice. with the cutting inside move in the basket. The part at the end, I mean, the whole reason gets someone open is that way they can knock down the shot in just three of 14 from deep. Running play by Natalie Leisinger. The give and go is good. And you see the results here. Butler has three players from Wisconsin. Wisconsin only has two players from Wisconsin. So Butler has out Wisconsin to Wisconsin in terms of recruiting. It's, oh, what a block. Wisconsin with numbers going to push it up the court with Ronnie Porter. Williams on the inside and one. And she is excited about that one to Wingler and Kent. Kent will go inside to James. James working her way around Sarah Williams and Sarah Williams denies. Wisconsin gonna hurry things up now on the other side of the court. Go give and go to Sarah Williams. She earned the double team, but no problem for her. She also draws the foul. Strandy trying to cut this 8-0 run by the Badgers. Another block by Sarah Williams. Jump ball. Looking for another screen. Ronnie Porter stifling defense, but Strandy on the oh. inside. Absolute nails by her. Great closeout defense from Butler there. It looks like Wisconsin is going to have some shots open, but they just got back to their spot so quickly. And Wiggins is going to take it herself with the floater, and she'll get the foul for a chance with the three-point play. Sarah Williams, that double team you see so strong for Butler. She'll give it back to Copeland, and up ahead pass. Sarah Williams with another basket for the Bulldogs. Janes from deep, right down Broadway. And that's a backbreaker for the Badgers. Strandy and Wiggins back and forth. They'll go inside to Janes once again. Janes with another basket, the silencer. Wisconsin's undefeated streak at home starting to slim down, but Ronnie Porter is going to take it up and in. Butler is going to get their first road win and for Wisconsin, their first home loss. Great matchup between these two power six foes.